Hi, this is Margot Poro from the Western Canadian Learning Network. Can you determine the value of digits in whole numbers? Let's take a look at this number, 7,465,328. The place value chart at the top of the screen can help when you are trying to determine the value of the number. Let's start with the largest digit, the millions. So, the digit 7 is in the millions place, and that gives it a value of 7 million, which can be written with numbers or with words. The digit 4 is in the hundred thousands place, so it has a value of 400,000, and again can be written with numbers or with words. The digit 6 is in the ten thousands place. It is worth six ten thousands, but we would more commonly say it has a value of 60,000. The digit 5 is in the thousands place and has a value of 5,000. This pattern continues. The 3 is in the hundreds place and is worth 300. The 2 is in the tens place and is valued at 20. The 8 is in the ones place, so it is simply worth 8. Let's look at this a bit differently and see how a single numeral such as 4 can have many different meanings or values. The 4 in the first number, 6,124,001, is in the thousands place. What do you think it is worth? Its worth or value is 4,000. The 4 in the next number, 42,305, is in the ten thousands place and is worth 40,000. The 4 in the final number, 2,847, is in the tens place. 4 tens has a value of 40. Notice that the number of places after a digit is the same as the number of zeros given after that digit to show its value. The 4 in the first number is in the thousands place. It is followed by three digits. When we give the value of 4, it is followed by three zeros in the same way to show the value of 4,000. The number of zeros is the same as the number of digits that follow the 4 in the original number. The 4 in the second number is in the ten thousands place. It is followed by four digits, so when we give the value of 4, it is followed by four zeros to show the value of 40,000. Again, the number of zeros is the same as the number of digits that follow the 4 in the original number. The 4 in the third number is in the tens place and is only followed by one digit. So when we give the value of 4, it is followed by only one zero to show the value of 4 tens, which is 40. Always remember, the number of zeros is the same as the number of digits that follow the 4 in the original number. Thank you for watching this video. This is Margot Poro for the Western Canadian Learning Network.